everybody wanna see it. It's once in a lifetime thing to see. And this is something which happens in a fraction of a second. The wild beast comes in closer to the river, and in a few minutes, they jump into the river and crosses the river. A few minutes, it's gone. But the problem is, everybody wants to get into the best position to see them jumping into the water. People don't respect these animals, especially in a migration time. People want to drive there. Some of them, they just park the vehicle. People block their way and intimidate the animals' behaviors. We stop them sometimes from crossing the river. You become a barrier between the world peace and the river. So they take a different road. Eventually, they end up crossing in the wrong place, which they don't know. We're forcing them to use even dangerous crossing. One of the horrible situations is pushing them and, and then they're taking a very high river bank. Jumping and landing onto the ground or landing onto a rock, they break the legs. And you're still faced by either this very steep bank, which you cannot climb to go back, you have to go into the water with already one broken leg. In this case, you're waiting for death. You'll be lucky if a crocodile swims and grabs you and takes you and drowns you. You lose a number which you probably could have not lost that number if they could have used the usual crossing points. Tourism is vital to wildlife conservation. But vehicles in these numbers disorient and intimidate the wildebeest's behavior.